you are empowered to perform a basic structural inspection of your own home. This video will equip you with the knowledge to identify potential issues and ensure your home's structural integrity. Why a DIY home structural inspection matters? A basic structural inspection can be a valuable tool for homeowners, giving you peace of mind and highlighting any potential issues before they become major problems. By understanding the fundamentals of your home structure, you'll be better equipped to make informed decisions about repairs and maintenance, which could potentially save you money in the long run. So grab your flashlight, put on your safety gear, and let's dive into this empowering journey of home structural inspection. What to look for? Foundation and walls. The foundation is the bedrock of your home structure. It supports everything above it, so it's crucial to ensure it's in good condition. Here's what to look for when inspecting your foundation and walls. Focus on cracks. Cracks in your foundation or walls can be a sign of shifting or settling. However, not all cracks are cause for concern. It's essential to understand the different types of cracks and their potential severity. Hairline cracks are generally not a cause for worrying, especially if they're only found in the drywall and can be easily fixed with some patching. However, any crack that is wider than a sixteenth of an inch or one and a half millimeters should be investigated further. If you notice any cracks that are wider, deeper, or have irregular shapes, consult a structural engineer for advice. Check for bowing or leaning. Bowing occurs when a wall section bends and doesn't return to its original shape. Leaning refers to a noticeable tilt in the wall. Both issues can indicate structural distress. Pay attention to interior and exterior walls, particularly those in basements or crawl spaces. If you spot any bowing or leaning, contact a qualified professional for an assessment. Look for moisture damage. Moisture is detrimental to your home structure. Water can seep into your foundation or walls, causing dampness, mold growth, or a condition called efflorescence, which is when white powdery substance appears on masonry due to water damage. These issues not only compromise the structural integrity of your home, but also create an environment where mold can thrive. Mold can pose health risks to you and your family. Addressing moisture problems promptly is crucial. What to look for, roof and attic. Your roof is at the forefront of protecting your home from the elements. Regular inspections will help you identify issues early, preventing them from escalating into more extensive and costly damages. But how can you effectively inspect your roof without climbing up there yourself? Well, it's simpler than you might think. Just visually inspect your roof from the ground level and look out for any missing shingles, sagging areas or signs of leaks. You can also use binoculars to get a closer look. Additionally, don't forget to inspect the interior of your attic. Proper attic ventilation is crucial for your home's structural health. Inadequate ventilation can lead to moisture buildup, which in turn can cause mold growth, insulation problems and even wood rot. So when inspecting your attic, look out for signs of insufficient ventilation, such as excessive insulation in the attic floor vents or block soffit vents. This way you can ensure your attic remains dry and well ventilated, safeguarding your home's structural integrity. Also, while in the attic, look for any obvious issues with the structural supports such as beams, joists or trusses. Check for signs of rot, damage or inadequate support. What to look for? Windows and doors. Ensuring that your windows and doors are installed and maintained properly is vital for your home's structural integrity. They form a protective barrier against the elements and play a role in maintaining energy efficiency. To inspect your windows and doors, first check the frames for any signs of damage, rot, or insect infestation. Ensure that the frames are securely fastened to the wall and that the joints are tight and in good condition. Next. Examine the seals around the windows and doors to ensure they're intact and effective. Look for any gaps, cracks, or areas where air or water might be leaking in. Damaged seals can compromise your home's energy efficiency and invite water intrusion, leading to potential structural issues. Additionally, check the sills and thresholds for any signs of water leakage, mold, or decay. What to look for? Siding and cladding. The siding and cladding of your home serve several important functions. They protect the underlying structure from the elements, enhance the aesthetic appeal and provide insulation. However, over time, these components can deteriorate due to exposure to weather, pests, or age. Inspecting your siding and cladding regularly is crucial to identify any damage or deterioration early. 
Start by visually examining your home's exterior, looking for any signs of damage, gaps, or areas where the siding has pulled away from the house. Pay attention to areas that are prone to water damage, such as around windows, doors, and corners. Look for signs of water intrusion, such as dampness, mold, or mildew. Also, if you have vinyl siding, check for any signs of warping, such as buckling, twisting, or shrinking. Vinyl siding can warp due to exposure to high temperatures or prolonged moisture. Any damage or deteriorating siding should be repaired or replaced promptly to prevent further issues. What to look for? The drainage system. Proper drainage around your home is crucial for preventing water from accumulating near the foundation. Excess water can seep into the cracks and crevices, causing various problems like foundation damage, mold growth and wood rot. To evaluate your drainage system, start by inspecting your gutters and downspouts. Make sure they are clean, free of debris and in good repair. Check for any leaks, breaks or loose connections. The gutters should direct water away from the foundation, so ensure the downspouts are extending at least 5 feet from the house and are directing water to a suitable drainage area, such as a storm drain or a dry well. Additionally, observe the grating around your home. The ground should slope away from the foundation to prevent water from pooling near the house. If the grating is incorrect and water flows towards your home, it can cause significant drainage problems. What to look for? Plumbing and electrical. While it's not the primary focus of a DIY structural inspection, briefly touching upon the plumbing and electrical systems is essential. Plumbing lines and electrical wiring are hidden within your home structure, so it's important to be aware of any potential issues that could arise. Signs of trouble include water leaks, frequent fixture repairs and unusual noses from pipes. Leaky pipes not only waste water, but can also cause structural damage over time. For electrical systems, look for outdated wiring, overloaded circuits, faulty outlets, or switches. Electrical problems can pose safety hazards and compromise your home's structural integrity. If you notice any red flags with your plumbing or electrical systems, it's best to contact a qualified professional for an inspection and any necessary repairs. What to look for? HVAC system. The HVAC system is another critical component of your home that can impact its structural integrity. When inspecting your HVAC system, look for signs of wear and tear on the furnace, air conditioner and ductwork. A malfunctioning HVAC system can lead to moisture buildup, mold growth and energy inefficiency. Pay attention to the condensate drain line, which carries away moisture from the AC system. Clogged or leaking drain lines can cause water damage and pose a health risk due to mold growth. Additionally, ensure that the system is properly insulated to prevent energy loss and maintain comfortable indoor temperatures. What to look for? Gas lines. If your home uses gas for heating or cooking, inspecting the gas lines is essential for safety reasons. Gas leaks can pose a significant risk and it's crucial to be vigilant. Look for signs of corrosion cracks or damage on the gas lines and appliances. If you suspect a gas leak or notice the smell of gas, immediately turn off the main gas valve and contact a qualified professional for inspection and repair. Call a professional. While DIY inspections are a great starting point, there are situations where it's best to call a professional. If you notice any significant issues or have concerns about the structural integrity of your home, don't hesitate to reach out to a qualified home inspector structural engineer or contractor. Professionals have the expertise and tools to conduct thorough inspections and provide accurate assessments. They can identify hidden problems, evaluate the extent of damage and recommend the best course of action for repairs or reinforcement. So when should you definitely call a professional? First, if you notice any severe foundation issues such as large cracks, uneven settling or visible cracks in the walls, foundation or brickwork, seek professional help. Similarly, if you observe any significant roof damage, such as missing shingles, sagging or leaks, contact a roofing expert. Additionally, if you see any signs of mold growth, water intrusion or moisture problems, bring in a professional for inspection and remediation. And finally, if you're planning to make any major renovations or are buying a new home, Hiring a professional inspector is highly recommended. They can provide you with a comprehensive report that will give you peace of mind and highlight any issues that need to be addressed. Understanding the structure of your home and conducting regular inspections will help you maintain its integrity and catch problems early. 
Don't wait for issues to escalate into major headaches. By being proactive, you'll ensure that your home stands strong for years to come. So put on your detective hat, inspect your home thoroughly and rest easy knowing you've done all you can to protect your sanctuary.